Ball games in the refrigerator. Doors closed. Lights are out. Put a shot in your my name is Matt, welcome back to the shop and today we're talking about multiple spark plugs so someone sent me a question through Facebook and loads of people have asked me before about multiple spark plugs so what is the point, what is the reason? well there are three, I say three reasons there are two reasons and one bullshit reason now we'll go with the three um, number one is redundancy redundancy so on just say something like the Spitfire, it's very common in aviation with piston uh, piston engines. Uh, with the Spitfire, with its Merlin engines, its V12, um, it used to have one spark plug here and one spark plug here, one spark plug here and one spark plug here. Two spark plugs per cylinder and each spark plug had its own magneto. Uh, well not each spark plug, each spark plug rail had its own magneto. This was because if one spark plug or one magneto went pop, titty wampus then there was another spark plug in the same cylinder to keep the fucking thing going because the last thing you want to happen is to fall out of the sky just because a magnet will shit the bed um, so redundancy and that is very very common in aviation with Rotax engines and stuff like that to have two spark plugs the second reason um, is flame propagation uh, propagation a shit colour but flame propagation so what you have is sometimes you have engines um, that have massive balls so some Harley Davidson stuff like that um, massive balls short strokes well oversized and uh, when you go up to higher RPMs what happens is is that the fuel is still burning um, when you get to the bottom dead centre and sometimes even on the way back up so basically what happens is is when you have a spark plug that fires it gets to about there and then you're beyond you're getting past the uh, bomb dead center and you're on your way back up and there's still this region and possibly other regions that still haven't burned properly uh, this is at higher rpm lower down rpm they don't give a shit about um, because there's enough time um, so what you do is you you fit two spark plugs so if you want to think about it like this you have one here you have one here so then this can get this side, this can get this side, and you get the whole thing in time. <coughs> the modern systems, sometimes what they do is they actually only fire one spark plug. The ECU will fire one spark plug until you get into the higher RPMs. Then it'll start to fire the dual spark plugs and so on. Um, because at slower RPM, there is enough time for that flame to propagate through the entire, um, through the entire cylinder, giving you proper complete combustion. Um, another reason based on that same kind of thing sometimes is when engines are not passing um, emissions testing generally due to weird combustion shapes and stuff like that sometimes um, but there are some engines that require there's extra spark plug just to make sure that they do burn everything um, so they can pass emissions testing and all the rest of it um, the third reason is just because it sounds cool. There's someone, a, a banger engine that had three spark plugs. Fuck knows why. There's no reason why a, two, a 200cc or a 125 engine requires three spark plugs. That's just to look cool. Or so. I don't get it. That's ridiculous. I don't know what that's for unless it's some kind of... I can't see any reason why you'd want three spark plugs. You want your event to happen at one time. And why you'd want three, I don't know. If we're talking about three electrodes, like you have like two ele uh, three electrodes or two electrodes on a plug, we'll talk about that in another video. That's something else-ish related. Nah, that's more spark plug technology and stuff. We'll do a video on that. But as far as it comes for engines, they have two spark plugs per cylinder for redundancy or because flame speeds, big ball engines and all the rest of it. You've got to remember it's not... Um, uh, not stroke length, actual bore, big bore to stroke relationships. Hope that makes sense, I'll see you in a bit. <laughs> 